Okay, so you want to split a string. Okay, normally this is your string, user one, user two, user three. Normally I'd recommend you using a regular expression, but they can be a little bit complicated. Not everybody wants to learn how to use them, okay? So we're going to use a while loop, okay, and we're going to use a dynamic x buffer. So we have a variable called subscribe, and within it, it contains user one, semicolon, user two, semicolon, user three, semicolon, okay? The while loop. We're going to have a condition. I'm just using tbox set buffer in there so you, you know what module I used, okay? And the little vertical bar is a separator. This is a while loop with a condition to avoid empty strings. Okay, so the condition is while well, this variable, subscribe, user1234, it's not equal to empty. That's what the exclamation mark is. Not equal to two double quotes. There's nothing in between them, okay? Not equal to empty. If that's the case, we're going to go into the loop. And in here, we're using dynamic buffer expression to buffer each word before the semicolon. So we're taking subscribe, which in the beginning contains user 1, 2, and 3. And we're using XB, and we're creating a variable or a buffer called subscribe 1 for the first time. Okay, and it'll basically walk up that string until it sees a semicolon. Okay, that's the delimiting pattern that is used. I put this into the text, the test step. Wouldn't necessarily do this in a production environment. I'm just doing it in this video to make it easy for people to basically follow along. Okay. So what happens to subscribe after we pull out user one? Well, that's what we're doing here. Okay. We need to basically um, strip it out so the next time it comes through, it sees user 2, semicolon, and it creates um, subscribe 1. So that's it. You can get away with this stuff, but if you really want to up your game when it comes to Tosca, use your regular expressions. I've got several videos on my channel. Maybe I'll, uh, maybe I'll put a card on the screen. But that's it. A short one. Um, oh, also, here is the QR code from my Telegram channel. It's 2,000 Tusky users, 2,040 at this stage. I'll export this subset and I'll put it up there so you can uh, you can have a look at it. Okay, cheers, bye.